Whoa. What is this? It's... It's like part 16. No, this can't be. It's not part 16. What is this? Oh, right. It's got to be a flashback. Because we're finally going to be over at the next Colossus. So you got to have a recap of sorts. Right. That makes a lot of sense. So let's see what Dorman has to say again. I know there's another foe. Into the valley. Uh-huh. Okay, so I'm looking for destroyed city. Got it. I think the flashback's ending. What the heck was that all about? Yeah! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! Finally we are heading over to the 15th Colossus. And we are heading north. Across lands that we've pretty much already been through before. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna cut ahead until I get around the area uh, that we, and I enter the place where Celosia is. You know, Colossus number 11. And then I'll resume from there. You'll see why. I think this is a good place to resume from. So yeah, Solosia is straight up ahead. Well, I'm not going to go exactly that way. What I'm going to do here is turn around the bend here. See where this mountainside is? Yeah, I'm going to go around there and look for a shrine. The shrine should be around the middle portion, sort of section area here, the desert. And you guessed it. There's a lizard, but don't worry, the lizard collecting will not be as extensive as it has been the last couple of parts, so you don't have to worry. <laughs> uh, oh, there it is. <laughs> I might as well get off here then and start lizard searching, I suppose. Oh, oh, I see it. I see it. Oh, it's gone. Wait, 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 no, I see it. <laughs> oh, man, where? I seen it go up the wall and then, ah. Oh, can I get it? Can I get it? Yes, I can! Oh, yeah! Taste that delicious lizard tail. And as long as you're here, don't forget to sightsee! Look at this desert! The, these sand dunes are massive! <laughs> you can even jump off some of them with aggro. Alright, I, I hear aggro flopping around down below, actually. But uh, where is she? Oh, there she is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now for the next location. I am going to go further. Ah, blah, 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 not this way. <laughs> I want to go like around, around. I say, <laughs> around and up here, because there's a whole castle over here. Woo! And there's one you can jump off of. <laughs> um, but before I go down there, I'm gonna hop down here to. Uh, well. When Agro lets me. <laughs> I guess you can't jump down there, that's fine. I'll just take the long way around. You don't have to go down here at all. I'm just showing you that there is stuff to explore down here if you would like to sightsee. Like, say, this sort of kind of bridge kind of place here. Calm down, Agro. It's just a wall. You've got, you're covered with hair. You would have no issue bouncing right off the wall without a scratch. I mean, your hair is pretty rough. Believe me, I ride on it all the time. <laughs> okay, now you've seen enough. Now, to get inside this castle slash civilization type place, you've got to go around the right side, and Agro here is uh, kind of sluggish up here. <laughs> That's okay. Alright, so let's go around and see where the opening is. It's coming, it's coming. There's the opening. Agro! Don't, don't, no, nope, 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 okay. And I'm going to get off right over here. Because there should be another lizard in this entrance way here somewhere around. I'd like to go up here to look for it because it likes to climb around this pillar. Uh, where is that little bugger? <laughs> oh, oh, I seen it. I seen it. Hey there. How was your day? Oh. <laughs> now, you tell me that the lizard is playing fair. Well, it's not. 
Oh, oh. Hold on. Oh, stop, stop, okay. Yeah, I got it! And that's the second and only lizard that I'm going to be getting this part. Four lizards remain. I'm going to get them all in the next part. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Um, I'm actually gonna have to leave aggro behind here because uh, there's a pillar over here But I can use her to jump up here and then aggro can you know sightsee <laughs> So uh, over here is sort of like a split path uh, you can go either either way around this central Type echoey area here, but I'm just gonna take this way. I don't think it really matters if I show both ways Do you I don't think so so I'm just gonna go <laughs> All right, up here. Well, we're almost up here. <laughs> but up here is the next Colossus. And it is going to rock your world. Are you excited? You should be. Because it's been a while since we battled a Colossus. Because of all those lizards and fruit. <laughs> I got a little bored of them. Uh, actually, because I was doing so many at once. I should have spread them out across more, but, well, I didn't. It's done, over with. So, here we are. Look at this place. Look at this place. The Colossus is just up ahead. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and no... <laughs> I'm, not, I'm just kidding. We've waited too long to see the next Colossus. But really, it is right up ahead. <laughs> we just gotta reach the end of this civilization slash coliseum type place. And you'll see why I call it a coliseum in just a second here. Oh yeah, whenever there's a cutscene, you know there's something, something coming up! It's the 15th Colossus Argus! And when I say it's gonna rock your world, it is going to rock your world because the shockwaves it makes actually can damage you. Now run! Run away! Go over towards one of those lower platforms on the upper level, if that makes sense to you. <laughs> these, these things right here, uh, that I'm on right now, they're kind of like teeter-totters. So what I want to do here is, see this lower ledge here? I want to go up there. Well, I can't reach that, so I'm going to need the assistance of Tall, Dark, and Gruesome. So uh, I'm just going to aggravate them a little bit here. It do that doesn't sound like the best of ideas, but it'll work nicely. <laughs> just uh, give them a couple puncture wounds here and there. It'll, it'll be okay. No problem whatsoever. Now watch for his foot. Wait for it. I'm telling you to wait for it. I said wait for it! Don't leave. Just wait. Okay, now jump! Ah, it still caused me damage, but that's okay. Now you see he lifted up that platform down there? Now when he takes his foot off, it goes back down. So that's the key to getting up here. This is like phase one of the battle. Now phase two begins. See all these blocks above your head? You gotta get him to shake these things down so you can climb up further. So you know what that means. It's time to aggravate him some more. <laughs> hey! See, this is where the arrows are coming from. I would have very much appreciate it if you were to, say, swing that mallet sword over here or punch the wall. That would work just as well. And, um, yeah. I, I, you wouldn't mind doing that for me, would you, good boy, Argus? Oh boy, here it comes! Get away. See, I took a little bit of damage there from the shockwave, but it's okay, it's only scratch damage. So now these things fall down, and you can start climbing up even further! So, let's go up! Whoa, 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 why did you do that? <laughs> oh, there we go! Now what you're looking for are stairs leading up, no matter which side you can go up. Uh, there will always be stairs leading up. There's four of these sides that you can go up around this place. So, uh, yeah, just always look for the side. Ah! Just always look for the sides that the stairs are going up. Now, from here, you got a decision. There's a bridge over there and a bridge over there. You can choose whichever bridge that you'd like. I prefer the middle one just because it's so. Yeah! In the middle of everything. Uh, but you'll see why I'm gonna choose the middle one here. So, what you wanna do here is aggravate him again! 
<laughs> Believe me, it works. He'll eventually turn around. He'll be like, ow, 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 ow. Oh, there he is. Now I'm seeing where he's shooting from. <laughs> Look at all those arrows in him. <laughs> all right, so after you do that enough times and he gets close enough to the bridge, he's going to do something. Wait for it. It's coming. It's coming. Here it comes. Woo! He breaks the bridge down. And this makes it easier to get on top of him. Oh, yeah. And since I was on the far side, I didn't fall down at all. And now, time to get the sword out. Let's pan that camera vertically so we can get our jump ready. And, wait, 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 wait for him to move his head forward, there we go, we are on! Let's do this! First vital is right here. Urgh! He doesn't have all that much HP, probably because it takes a while to defeat him, you know, just to get up here and all like that. But, uh, yeah, just make sure he doesn't shake you off, because it took you a good amount of work to even get up here. <laughs> Just keep that R1 button held like you've never held the R1 button before and you're like, ah, I've got to tense up my finger so hard that I will never, ever let go of that R1 button. Because he will make you fly off him if you aren't holding the R1 sometimes. Uh, so it should be gone almost. Uh, oh, there we go. Alright, now i got to recover some stamina here. Uh, preferably without falling off for obvious reasons. Now, for a second weak point, we gotta go to the hand that is holding the sword club thing. The, whoa, 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 whoa. The reason why is because the palm of his hand contains the, the second weakness. So how do we get... Oh, how do we get him to reveal that second weakness? Oh, you'll see. Just keep watching. I'm just trying to recover some stamina here. Not really a big deal to do so. Just a matter of being patient and uh, maybe stabbing him a little bit. <laughs> Actually, maybe not. That's not helping all that much. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He's calming down. Calming down. Okay. Stamina recover. No, stamina. Don't decrease. <laughs> Come on. Just recover. Recover. Recover like an Alakazam. Okay, I'm gonna release the R1 for a bit as it recovers the stamina a little faster. Eh, I'll eventually get it, don't worry. By the way, I'm on the shoulder that leads to the correct arm. So yeah, I'm, I'm uh, sort of used to this because I had a lot of trouble with this guy the first way through uh, the game because I, it was for all the wrong reasons, basically. I didn't know that there was fuzz on, his, on the palm of his hand to grab onto. And uh, I thought you had to like swing the sword at his palm uh, while standing on the, his fingertips, but uh, yeah, that, that was the completely wrong method. You actually, you always have to be grabbing on with R1 in order for you to be able to swing at the uh, vital point. And he's not letting me recover vitals very quickly, is he? <laughs> All right, you know what? Maybe this is enough. I did this before with lower vitals. I can do it again. So okay, let's start uh, dropping off the front here. Oh God. <laughs> what you want to do is drop down when his arm is swinging forward, otherwise, ah, oh, poopers, you'll fall off, and you have to redo the whole thing from the start, aside from the damage on the head. So I'll see you back up top. Well, at least I can recover stamina up here. It's a lot easier up here to recover stamina than on the big brute there. Come on, lean forward, lean... Well, that's, that should be good enough, actually. Yeah, there we go. Alright, round two starts. No roaring, please. Ah, you roared, of course, just because I said not to roar. I could tell he was going to do it there because... Yes, I know, Dorman, that I'm taking a while. I know where his hidden vitals are. <laughs> um, so let me get to uh, the back of the side of your arm, please. That would be very nice. Just stop shaking. Stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, go here. Okay, now, uh, with your sword out, you should be able to see that there is one of those special bluish-greenish spots over here. 
See that? Yeah. All I gotta do is stab that once, and he'll drop his sword club. Ready? 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 Uh, uh, maybe this is good enough to stab it. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, nope, not good enough. Gotta be a little bit lower. I just thought I would try that for kicks to see see how much I could push it. Okay, just get a little lower there, one there. This should be good. Good. And now he drops the club. And from here, what you want to do is get into his palm. Somehow. This is pretty difficult, actually. <laughs> this is probably one of the most difficult vitals to reach in the game, in my opinion. So here we go. What I want to do here is drop down when his arm is moving forward, like I said before. Uh, but I gotta be sort of on the front of the arm to do so. And that's kind of difficult to do. Well, I can do it here. Oh! Okay. Because he stopped, and that was why I was able to drop down. And I just gotta move myself to the right. Don't run out of stamina, Wander. Please, I am begging you to not run out of stamina. But I am this close to the palm. See it down there? Oh god, I'm low on stamina. Very low. Please stop moving. Please. Let me drop down safely. <laughs> well, I can drop down to here. I know that. And... Ah, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on there. Hold on there. Ow! Oh, 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 oh! Oh, man. I recovered, like, a little bit of stamina in air. That's why I re-grabbed onto him. But, uh... Yeah, you see what I'm trying to do here is to get into his palm by dropping down before I run out of stamina. But that's, uh... That's a tricky feat to do, let me tell you. <laughs> Dang it, Dorman, I know! We just seen the hidden vitals before the cut! Whoa, Nelly! <laughs> okay, I got more stamina this time. He's like, ah, my acupuncture is wearing off! Must move around to regain mobility because of arthritis. For being ancient colossus god, it's... The body wears down a little bit. <laughs> Don't. Come on, let me down. Let me down. Actually, I could probably drop off here. Oh, oh, poopers. This isn't a good place to drop down. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, maybe I can work with it here. A little bit. Eh, mm, I don't know. Mm, eh. No, I'm, I think I'm going to try again from the start by going back up to his shoulder to recover his stamina. Geronimo! Woo! Okay, that's much better. Okay, let's get into his palm. Come on, come on, come on. Just a little bit more. Stop moving. I know! Stop it, Dorman! <laughs> it's taking me a while, I know. Okay, stop moving. And I'll be able to drop down safely. Relatively safely. <laughs> Okay. No, 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 no. In the palm. In the palm. No, 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 no. Don't. Wait, 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 wait. I'm up. No, 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 no. No. I got it. Yes. Yes. All right. So here is the point where you can start stabbing to an extent. You know, he's going to try and shake you around a little bit, but the idea of keeping the stamina so that you can do this. Hold on while he tries to shake you off, basically. Yeah! Eat dirt! Oh god, here comes the black smoke and technically thingies. It's... This part's over, I can tell. So I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part. Thank you.